hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and it's been quite a while. It's been quite a while, um, you know, pretty much, it, the way just didn't have, you know, ideas, but I'm back. I think it's about four months, uh, yeah, it's been a, it's been a long streak, but hey, I'm back. Uh, we're back for a, a new video, and this video is actually, uh, I won't say a Christmas haul, but it's the things that I got for Christmas. And these are one of them. One of them is a IndyCar diecast, which is this one. The 2020 podium finish. Yeah, I think it's a 2020 podium fi finish. And I got a LEGO Speed Champion that I'm going to do a review. But let's start off with this one first. And yeah, it's feels a little bit different. Maybe I was gone for a little bit too long. Yeah. Yeah, now I feel like it, this is very different. But hey, you know, we got to get back. So, first, let's start off with the box. Uh, this is actually my first IndyCar diecast. I never got an IndyCar diecast for sure. And, you know, just never. Uh, I was thinking to get one for the channel. But just because I never got an IndyCar diecast. But uh, I was planning, but at the end, I didn't got it. But then, now I did for Christmas. So, I said, why, why not do a review? This is a perfect review as for the YouTube channel. So, so let's look at the box, then we take it out. So pretty much this is uh, the 2020 podium finish, which is, uh, damn, I cannot pronounce those names. The only drivers I know in IndyCar is Scott Dixon, Joseph Newgarden, Alex Pillow, Elio Castroneves, Simon Pagino, but I'm not really into IndyCar. I'd rather go to Formula 1, to be honest, than IndyCar. But it, it's a f fun sport, I gotta admit. It's like it's like American cousin of Formula One. But yeah, um, yeah, I'm only gonna read the ones that I know. So I'm just gonna s just the number thirty car, I guess. And then we got Scott Dixon, Grant, um, Graham Rahul. Man, I'm really bad with reading names, am I? So yeah, this is just the uh, the Indy car, Indy five hundred podium finish for 2020. So we got. We got the three cars, which who finished first, second, third. Um, and then we got here Greenlight. Now Greenlight is the one that makes the IndyCar diecast, and not only they make IndyCar IndyCar diecast, they also make different series like Hinch and Toe. That's one of them, or like vehicles, like movie vehicles that they use in the movie and they make it into a diecast. So that's the uh, the Greenlight. It's very I know Greenlight very good, but. We have right here Indy 500, August the 23, 2020. I was right. And then we got Game Bridge. It just uh, ate it up. And the 104th running. This is the 104th Indy 500. And uh, 164. And then we got, uh, yeah, I knew it was a Japanese driver. Yeah, it took a. Damn. It's kind of annoying when I can't read the names. Pit stops five times, I bet. And then starting grid, third, he started third and let 27 laps. Scott Dix, in the other hand, pit, pit five times, started second on the grid, lap, let, laps led 111. Wow, I actually didn't expect no one to lead that much in Indy 500. And Graham led, uh, oh no, he led zero, but pit stops five, starting grid eight. So they all had the same pit stops, and, but this one had zero. Well, Graham, I mean, uh, Dixon, you... Finish second because you start in second. Interesting. What a coincidence. So, yeah, um, yeah, I, I'm actually really excited. And yeah, let's open it up. And here are the cars. And we're gonna go to third all the way to first. So the one who finished third on the podium is the driver Graham. Uh, yeah, like I said, I don't know how to pronounce his name. Graham. I'm just gonna say Graham. The driver of the number 15. And then we come up closer. Yeah, I'm gonna go right here. This is actually I thought it was gonna be a little bit bigger, but actually there's small, a little bit smaller than I thought. So we have the th uh, 15 of gram, and yes, on the way I was taking out this thing was delegated than I thought. It actually broke when I was taking off because the wires were surrounding it, and I was pulling it because I was like, why is it so stuck? And little did I knew I. Broke it on the way. So what I did was I just connected back like this. 
it's a, but it's very dedicated. So yeah, it's gonna yeah just to let you guys know. Yeah, my bad, shame on me. Uh, but yeah, so let's get on the diecast review. Uh, so first we got the. Hopefully you guys can focus. Um, it's like a lot of glare. Let me see if I could. Let's see without a light, cause I'm using the light. I guess you guys can kind of see. I'm not sure if that's helping, but let's see. You know what? I'm gonna use the light. Yeah, hopefully that focuses it. Focuses it more. Yeah, cause the the things are small. So let's just let's just start. Let's go with it. So we got United. This is a United rent Rentals. So this is United Rentals. United Rentals, the number 15, and this is the manufacturer of Honda. And we got United Rentals right here on the on the on the sides right there. And this is like the front splitter. I'm not sure if that's what they call it, splitter, like NASCAR. You know, I'm only know NASCAR stuff. So this is like I call it a splitter. Yeah, that popped out. Yeah, I knew that wasn't gonna last long. Let's just leave it right there. So we got the front splitter, and with the wheels right here. And then we got United Rentals. That's the Fifth Third Bank. And we got that canopy right here. This is the uh, new invention they did. Like I think this last year, 2020 was the first year they would use this canopy, supposed to protect the drivers from anything like hitting. Like it's just more safety. So that's the they call it canopy and the. The air goes the top of their head, and I think they add like like holes right here so the air could go through through here the nose and go to the driver. I think they did that, but anyway. So yeah, uh, this is the new invention. I think they're cool. They're not they, they don't mess up the shape of the car, but yeah, I think it's cool. It looks like more like a jet to be honest. So and then we got fifteen right there. Then we got Honda for Fifth Third Bank. Then we got that shape right here, a shape right there, and yeah. So in a row, it's pretty smooth. And yeah, we got the little wing. Yeah, and it says right there. Since I broke it, let me give you a close up look. What it says right there. Uh, it says turns for troops. Dot com. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, it says. Transfertroops.com. So yeah, uh, not bad. This uh, this uh, does look nice, and it's it's uh, you can't really read the small little logos because the camera are not used this. Uh, I don't think any camera is gonna be used to read those tiny logos, but uh, really nice. Uh, it does not roll smooth. The only ones that's bumpy is like at the front ones right here, pretty much. So yeah, now let's go. Who finished second, which is Scott Dixon. Scott Dixon finished second on the podium. So this one to start at the front again. Now, oh, this one you can read more. We got PNC, the number nine. And then we got NTNT logo right there. NTNT of the series. And we got Honda. We got PNC. I wonder what that is sponsored. And we got, you know, the splitter. You know, they have different colors. They got blue. This one's blue, and it has that yellow shade right there yellow right there and white on that at the end and then we got pnc bank pnc bank also right there we got that or little orange right there pnc and we got a little stuff right there written i can't even read it but you got a little bit blue right there and then we got the canopy and this one's uh i forgot to mention that this one's uh they also add like a little paint like paint scheme right here around the top of the canopy and we got this is a, I think that's a, that's where they add the fuel. Yeah, I think this is where they add the fuel when they come to pit. I think that's where they add it. And then, yeah, uh, nice. And it's this one's not broken. This one's not. I was careful on this one because that was the first one card that I took out. So that's why this one was broken. So, uh, yeah, pretty much really nice. Uh, uh, I I did expect the more from it. Oh yeah, and I forgot these are not plastic tires. These are rubber tires and chrome tires. The the t the paint of this is chrome. So I like that. I like when they make the 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 hubcaps not like fake. They make it like try to make it real, which is chrome. I like it. They used to do that with the NASCAR hauler die cast, but it, now they put it like the paint fake, which I did. I was really not happy about that one. But yeah, so not bad. I like it. So, 
Let's put this inside. And now the first place who won the uh, who won the 2020 Indy 500, the 104th running, is I'm just gonna say the number 30 car. The number 30 car. And right here. So this one is white and blue and with a little bit orange uh, right here. So let's start off on the front. We got 30 Honda. Oh, all of them are oh, Hondas. Manu uh, all of them. All of the Honda manufacturer finishing top three. Interesting. And then we got the number 30 NTT. Then we got a little side sponsors. And then we got. The blue, a little bit on the blue on the sport. Uh, I mean, not spoiler, splitter, white right there, white right there, and then you know, and then we got a little bit orange right there, and then we got nice blue right here. People, what's this sponsor? It's people. Let me read it right here. People is ready. This is people ready. People ready. People ready. People ready, people ready. So, I don't know. I never heard that sponsor. Then we got Honda, and I can't pronounce that uh, sponsor name. And that includes that one. So, and we got the number 30 right here. And we got the canopy right here. Pretty nice looking car. And then we got the wheels. This one is not all color chrome. It's the same one as the number 15 car, Graham. So, both of them are just, they have the same one. So, and then we got the wing right here. And now, what, now what I'm going to do is do a comparison with a NASCAR diecast. So, the first thing I could tell is, both of them are 164. Let me just zoom out. Both of them are 164. Yeah, yeah, NASCAR just beats it by just a little bit the length. The length of it, just a little bit burly. And by the thickness, mm, not so much. Uh, I think IndyCar is a little bit thicker because of this. It's a little bit thicker because of these things. So, yeah, the, so NASCAR gets the length, beats the length, but the, the wideness does not. So... But they're actually pretty much the same size. They're not magnificently different. Just that this one is lower. This one is lower. Lower than that one. Which is obvious. But um, yeah. Not much of a difference. Uh, comparing to an Asker diecast. And an in IndyCar diecast. So that will be it to for today. Now let me zoom out. And put the podium finish. I'll put this back because it felt when I was putting it back again. Yeah, I'm gonna just gonna have to put Gorilla Glue or something. Yeah, stay there for at least today. Just stay there. Okay, there it goes. So yeah, that's all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to write a comment down below and smash that like button. And if you don't, if you don't want to miss any video, hit that bell. So thank you guys for watching this video and see you next time. Bye.